YouTube, what is going on? Savage here. Today's video is for you guys out there that play Rebirth Island. There's a pandemic going around Rebirth and it's just bad gameplay and it's bad teamwork and it's just not paying attention to things around you. These videos here will help you guys hopefully get out there and improve. It's a respawn mode. There's no reason for you guys to be four stacked in a corner afraid to get out there and, and practice, man. Rebirth is a great mode to get your practice in. Caldera, you might not get that many gunfights, but Rebirth, Fortune's Keep, you'll get in a lot of gunfights. Use it to your advantage. Get out there. Become a sweat. Stop hiding in the corner like a baby back. All right, right off the bat, spectating Reaper crouch walking while he loots. That is the... We're in for a real good treat right here. Now, look. Um, I want to start making the, the series on Rebirth known as the Rats of Rebirth. Because that's usually what we spectate. Now, not every Rebirth player is a rat, but unfortunately, that's... All right, your boy Reaper definitely lacking with reaction time, definitely lacking with aim. Um, that was awkward. Dude came right in front of us, should have just wide wide, canceled the animation, got the shots off. That's a pretty simple one. Um, but it's amazing to me that people have been playing Reaper for, for this long um, still struggle. Let's look at Reaper, for instance, and I'm not going to hate. I'm trying my best not to troll this video. I want to give real tips and tricks um, because people like Reaper clearly need it. He's a level 319 prestige, so he's been playing this game for a while. Let's look up his stats in real time, too. But one thing I want you guys to notice is his slides. He's not slide canceling. Slide, oh, there's... Oh, oh, we got it. Never mind. He just... Oh, there. And then... You see what I'm saying? Sometimes he gets it. Sometimes he doesn't. And at least he's practicing. I got to give him credit. Most players just fucking sprint without trying to do anything. But at least he's practicing. Um, but your dude Reaper definitely needs to fucking perfect slide canceling. It's very easy. Slide, slide, sprint. Slide, slide, sprint. Slide, slide, sprint. That's, that's it. Controller, mouse, keyboard, slide, slide, sprint. That's all you got to do. Um, I will say, after practicing controller, I'm on like 10 days now or whatever. Um, it is harder to, to slide cancel. It's harder to B hop. It's harder to do a lot of things without paddles. Now, you can still do it. Just go and claw a little bit. Um, but while shooting enemies, it could be a little difficult for you guys. So I definitely encourage you all to try to get some kind of paddle attachment or a controller with paddles. Um, it sucks to say that, but it is what it is, unfortunately. Here we are dropping our money for Lodi. Our, teammate just, uh, our teammates do not give a fuck. They are not moving towards that loadout at all. And again, that's just being good teammates. I don't care if you're randoms. I don't care what it is. Pay attention to your squad. Pay attention to what they're doing. Here we have Reaper getting shot by King. And instead of just ADSing and shooting back, he jumps right towards him before he even shoots a bullet. I don't even think we got a bullet off. Very bad play. Talk about an ego challenge. Your boy was just trying to fucking throw his throw his titties in his face. Moving on to Brian motherfucking McNett. All right, with a name like that, bro, I'm expecting big things. We have red skin above us, and instead of pushing up there and getting a kill, we're going to come in here and do nothing. Oh, we got a crossbow gamer. My dude tried to drop shot, brother, but 999, the B-hop of greatness, popping a nice little three or four bounces like a bunny rabbit, getting the fucking kill off of Brian McFucking McNett, or motherfucking McNett. Is he, yo, you have a gun in your pocket, brother? You're just happy to see me. Look at that. All right, we're going to move on. Look, if you're this guy, just bleed out. Don't wait for your teammates to res. You just bleed out. I think he's AFK, but a lot of people do this shit. Bleed out. It's a respawn mode. Don't put your teammates in a bad position because you don't want your KD to get tanked. That's fucking selfish. Don't do that stupid ass shit. Tip number two. All right, here we have two guys holding each other's hands. Your boy fire. literally shooting before the enemy was even in the fucking frame. Awkward. Green's in a fight right now. We're too busy looting. He needs help. Now he's dead. So here we are. Hiding in a corner. Yes. That's what I'm talking about. Respawn mode. You come back. You're not last alive. You can fight. One, you should have fought with your teammate instead of looting. Two, you need to plate the fuck up. And three, don't ever hide in corners. He gets the kill. Cool. But if that guy would have been B-Hop of Greatness, Mr. 999, this guy would have fucking died. No doubt about it. Again, camping in corners, you, you might get lucky and get a... Look at this. What are you shooting at? Trigger discipline. Don't shoot unless the enemy's in the crosshair, homie. Or you're like pre-firing a corner you think he's going to be at. That was not pre-firing. That was just... I don't know what the fuck that was. Second time he's done that. 
Here we have Smiley Face take him down with the MP7. A lot of a lot of people using old school MW weapons right now. Dude, this squad is just we're we're gonna be stuck with them the whole time, aren't we? Tracking extremely off right now. Very unfortunate. We have the enemy dead to rights, and he could not hit his shots. Here we are spectating uh, Frowny Face, rocking 10. We're going to skip him. We're going to... What? 999 B Hop of Greatness has one kill? What? No shot, dude. After uh, after that display of beauty, beauty, I thought for sure he'd be on a banger, but he's maybe he's got a lucky beat. What are you doing, homie? I'm going to fight you. That got dangerous. He's asking for money, but Greed's over here just living up to his name. So, I mean, I don't know what you expect from a guy named Greed. He is fucking clueless. He's dropping his weapons, he's dropping his stems, and he's running away. <laughs> People like this should be banned from the game. I'm sorry. You should be able to take your teammates' money. You should be able to walk up to them, hold X, and swipe their pockets. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. But you know what? Finding finding good teammates is the hardest thing in Warzone. It's harder than getting good movement. It's harder than getting good aim. It's literally the most difficult thing because half these guys are around blindfolded, not giving a shit about anything. It's It's wild. It's wild out here. But Mr. Frowning Face calling in UAV, trying to chase down some pings. We have three stacks of greatness in front of us. He's got to be careful. Never mind. They're all laying prone. They're all laying prone at the, the Lodi. Now, look, I want to make a good example of why. If you listen to streamers, you're probably dumb. I'm kidding. That was a little harsh. But do not believe Kilo's the meta if, from anyone. I don't care who they are. I don't care what they're fucking... What, how many subs they have. I don't care how many viewers they pull. You, did you just see how many bullets he put into those guys laying prone and what this Kilo failed to do? Failed to knock them. The Automaton would have got him. The NZ, of course. The KG, for sure. The UMG, hell yeah. Any weapon that's actually good would have knocked two of those three enemies. But instead, we almost died. We didn't get a single knock. And um, here we are. If you want to use the Kilo because you really enjoy it by all stretch of imagination, use the gun you love for sure. But don't be don't be coming in people's chat talking about Kilo's the meta. You might look dumb. I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna piss off a lot of people saying that in this video. You know, someone in the comments will be like, "He's savage," but so and so dropped the fucking 30 kill game. Remember, dude, great players can drop fucking 30 kill games with a pistol. My guy, did you drop a 30 kill game with a Kilo? That's the question. Rats of Rebirth. That man ran right into a three stack. And then here's another rat finally getting what he deserves. 999 going down for sitting still in a shed. Beautiful. Beautiful. But again, he did get three stacked also. Um, three stacks of pandemic in Warzone. It doesn't matter what mode. First stacking was three and four stacking was just a Rebirth Island thing. Then when they took Rebirth Island away and forced Fortune's Keep on the Rebirth players, they said, fuck you guys. And they started coming to Caldera. Then Caldera started getting infested with three and four stackers. So then all the Caldera sweats, like us, we were forced to three and four stack as well to fight the three and four stackers. It's just a pandemic out here, honestly. It really is. But here's Aquaman just mounted, praying someone walks right in his line of sight. Again, dude, don't just wait for enemies to come to you. Go hunt down enemies. Again, the Kilo just really showing its skill. Ooh, I love this gun. The best ever. It's amazing, dude. I, I know what people are t talking about the Kilo being good. And the Kilo is not a bad gun, but it's not fucking meta. It's not. Your boy also has 129 ping, bro. Rest in peace. Ayo, Gates for president. Just completely blown away by all the loot. We're going to sit up on the corner and we're going to sit here and have the most fun in the world. People always say, Savage, don't make fun of these people. They're having fun. Nah, he's not having fun. You're a liar. Nope. 
Again, Aquaman um, definitely don't bleed out if it's disabled. We have we have an assault rifle we could use, but we're gonna decide to shoot with the Blixen at that range anyway. That's that's awesome. Be mm, I'm pretty sure his shoulder's vulnerable. It's a 4v5, so 4v3v1, 4v or 4v3v2, some shit like that. Nine bullets, and here we are just, again, observation, just paying attention to your HUD is it, it, probably the most slept on thing in all of Warzone. People don't pay attention to their HUD. Not their ammo count, not their plate count, not their teammates, not the teammates callouts, not the kill feeds, not the timer and the disabled, not the mini map, not the circle, not the pings popping up on mini map, not the kill count, nothing. People, the compass, fuck that. They don't not pay attention. Look at this. What are you doing, my guy? Well, if you're just doing this, you're just going to get shot. You're just moving. You're not. You're just turning. That's all you're doing. Doing. Don't do that. Zigzag wide, brother. Not, not, you don't want to type that shit up. Look, let your teammate die. Yeah, bait that motherfucker, and we gotta rotate. We're coughing. We're probably gonna get shot in the head anyway. But it's your own fault because you waited to last second to rotate. You decided I want to play the edge of the gas because it's the cool thing to do, and you got caught out. Should have pre-rotated. People refuse to pre-rotate because they think they're cute. They think they're clever, but in reality, this is exactly what the fuck happens. It is amazing to me the amount of goaded players we don't get to spectate. Honestly. I feel like I feel like Rebirth doesn't have as many goats in there as people think they do. There's a lot of lower tiered players. Um, re winning Rebirth is easy. And if we, if me and my squad decided to play Rebirth for an entire day, we would probably win 90% of our games. It's not difficult. You just have to pay attention, dude. That's literally it. Hunt down kills, move around, pay attention, work together. You don't have to play together. We don't stack, but work together. Meaning, combine your money, buy loadies. If your team needs help, go help them out. Um, if you're last alive, don't be going out there getting killed. Um, and sure as fuck, don't camp in a corner. It's weird. But yeah, every team we we saw a little the same shit. I, I feel like this spec this you know it's good spectating Fortune's Keep because it was a different change of pace. But reverse the same shit. People camping in corners, people hiding, nobody wanting to actually play the game. Meow. Meow. I'm gonna eat those you. cats. Mm, I'm gonna cut him up oh, oh, daddy. Yeah. oh my god. Oh, I will do more than that. 